Okay, you guys, this is 31 Weeks Part 2. I just wanted to finish showing you guys the um, stuff from my baby shower. So if you missed 31 Weeks Part 1, um, I showed you this little guy, which is going to hold forks and stuff like that, um, that I made. All these things that I bought were from Family Dollar. One dollar, one dollar, and some hot glue. Um, I showed this which has pink and white flowers in it. Um, this is also from Family Dollar, one dollar and one dollar, and then little flowers. And this is gonna be for like um, raffles and things like that. People's names we're gonna pull out of here. I had just got finished showing my centerpieces that I made. Um, it's a ladybug theme, if you haven't noticed that already. Um, I got this from Joann's, and I just glued some pink and red and white polka dot ribbon on it, some red and white polka dot ribbon, these little black sparkly things I glued on there, um, and I glued flowers on the lid. The lid pops off, and inside is um, just a little shower gel lotion to get it shower, big shower. <laughs> um, and these will be Sitting in the tables as a centerpiece, I have some, um, this pink stuff that's going to go, the little pink circles, um, that they're going to sit on because the tablecloths are going to be red. So that'll make it pop. And when people play Baby Shower Bingo, um, the winners of Baby Shower Bingo, there will be five winners, and they'll just get to take the centerpieces off, and they come with a little handle, and they'll just get the gift that's inside, and then they can keep the container and use it for anything if they want to. Um, this was my baby shower bingo template that I showed. Um, what I was saying was it can be found on parents.com under baby shower games and you can just download the template. I just used my computer to make it pink and red and add ladybugs to it. So if you know how to crop and copy and paste and clip art and all that, you can change it to whatever your theme is. These are the name tags that I got for um, people that come. There's 40 of them just because the two sides of the family are going to be like kind of meeting for the first time, like the extended family, the aunts and the uncles and stuff. So I want everybody to have a name tag so we can all get to know each other. Well, like our, our families can get to know each other. Um, this is just a flyer for the tables and chairs and tents that we're going to rent. Um, I got some little balloons. There's only six in here, but they're the little balloons, the feet balloons that say it's a girl. So I'll probably get some more of those. Those are pink. And I plan on having red and white balloons as well. Um, the strainers. I got two packs of the white and the pink and the red. I have um, the ribbons for me and Keith to wear to show that we're the parents. Um, I ordered these little pink clips for the Don't Say Baby game. Um, I got these off of eBay for really cheap, like $2 or something like that. And then, you know, um, Measure Mommy's Girth, we're going to play that. And um, instead of just using yarn, like most people normally do, I found this at Joann's. And it's actually like a measuring tape. And I thought that was so cute. There's 150 feet. So we better not run out because I'm going to be mad. Like, do people really think I'm not that <laughs> if we run out of 150 feet of this tape? But it just says the new mommy's size, what is the new mommy's size on it, and it keeps going and repeating itself. So, um, yeah. So those are the things that I have so far for the baby shower. This is just a vase that I found that we already had in the house that has ladybugs on it. 
So I'll put some red flowers in there. It'll just sit somewhere, like by the food or something. These are my favors. I just got finished making them last night. And they look like this. And they just have like six or seven pieces of candy in them. And then I'll open one. Inside they also have something that I got made. And what they are are their little magnets and they say Sharita's baby shower. And then they have September 25th, 2010, and it says, thank you for sharing this day. And it has little Pooh and friends on there, the baby version of them. So I thought that is so cute, you guys. And I know it's backwards because it's a camera, but um, these are very cute magnets. And for $20, I got 30 of them. And this came off of eBay, an eBay store. Um, I got these made, so... Each bag has one of these in it and some candy, and then it's just tied up. So, those are my favorites that I've done so far. And then, um, yeah. And oh, the little bags that they're in, the little ladybug themed, um, ladybug themed bags. Those also came off of eBay, and I got 40 of those for like $5. And as you can see, I only did 30 favors. I sent out 25 invites, and um, I know a few extra people are coming, but um, I only have 30 magnets, so I only did 30 favors. And if you come and you're an extra person, you might just not get one, because I didn't invite you anyway. But now I'm just kidding. <laughs> but um, I have 10 left over, so... And that is it. Um, I still have to get, so I still have to decide which other games I'm going to play because I have the door entry game, which is the Don't Say Baby game. At the end of the shower, we'll figure out who has the most pins, give them a prize. Um, baby shower bingo, which is going to be played while I'm opening the gifts. Um, we have five of these, five of these winners. I have gifts in all of them. They are all, lo one is lotion, three of them have these pink baby showers, <laughs> three of them have the pink um, body washes in them, mm, sorry, and um, this one has, open up, this one actually has a necklace in it, necklace and a pair of earrings. Um, from Avon, so whoever gets that one is going to have a little different gift than everybody else. So I hope nobody's jealous, but I'll let them pick anyway which one they want so nobody feels like I was playing favorite. And, um, oh, the Measure Mommy Stomach Game. So that's what? Three games? Yep. Three games, and I think I'm going to do the um, dirty diaper game, but I need you guys' opinion. I was either going to take the rest of this fabric that I got from um, when I bought her bedding, and I was going to make the little fabric dirty diaper game, where you make, like, all the little diapers, and one of them is dirty, and you put them in, like, a container and have people draw them out, and then say, who has the dirty diaper, and they open it, and whoever has the brown spot inside wins. Or, I was going to use the diapers that I got for um, registering the samples, and I was going to do the melted candy bars in those, and pass like four diapers around with different candy bars in them, and have people guess which candy bars. Um, I think that one will probably be a little bit more hands-on and fun, but I don't know. I'll have to do multiple winners for that, probably. So, let me know which one you guys think would be more fun to have. And, um... I think I'm going to do one more game. So if you guys have any ideas on what my last game could be, please let me know. I'm looking for creative stuff, not something that people have 
done a whole bunch of, or that people always do at the baby shower. Like, I want to do something different and kind of something hands-on and fun. So, um, yeah, guys, so that is it. That is the rest of my baby shower stuff, and that is the end of week 31. On to week 32. Time is flying. I cannot wait. And um, I guess I will see you guys next Sunday for some more updates and some more fun stuff. So thanks for watching. Bye.